Hi guys. So today I have a skin brightening mask for you that also lightens the skin tone but with regular usage. So let's see what are the magic ingredients. So in one bowl I have this rice flour that's chawal ka atta and I'm taking some in an empty bowl by approximation. I'm taking less so I don't waste any ingredient. And then I am mixing some milk in it. Just taking some more so as to form a thick paste. Uh, exactly like this so so that it does not spills much and stays put on the skin now just start applying this thick mask on your face and meanwhile i'm applying this let's know why this is good for the skin so firstly rice is rich in so many minerals and high on the nutritional side like it's loaded with vitamin b especially then it also contains sun protecting agents uh, which can act as a natural sunscreen for you and it's anti-inflammatory it soothes the sunburns and protects the skin from suntan and it also helps in acne and pigmentation spots also because rice powder is a bit coarse in its texture so it makes it an excellent material to be used as a scrub so therefore a rice flour is very good for detanning and brightening up the complexion and after applying it in thick layers now just leave it for about 20 minutes and just wait for it to dry up and now let's see what milk does so you try using raw milk that's rich in vitamin B, antioxidants and so many nutrients like vitamin A, D, B6, biotin, protein, lactic acids and has so many benefits for the skin like moisturizing and nourishing the skin, tissue repair and growth, helps in anti-aging, it also protects against sun damage. So after the 20 minutes are over just take some water and start scrubbing the mask so the removal process became quite messy for this mask and after you have scrubbed it off let's wash the face so it brought some natural glow and made me so super soft and guys don't expect anything drastic after just one use you gotta be patient i mean just try it for at least a week after masking let's moisturize and that's the body shop vitamin e cream and then i'm using this karma ayurveda rose water spray on my face this is so much refreshing and lastly, I'm using this sheer lip butter by Body Shop. So after, after doing it, I just captured two stills from the video to see the difference. The left one is before masking and it looks dull and lifeless to me. Whereas the right one looks hydrated and glowy from within. And we cannot expect any miracle just after one day of usage but this definitely worked for me so try it and let me know your thoughts about this mask bye guys